previously on Lost Judgment. You know, I gotta say, I don't know how I feel about the Count of Files so far. There's not really much story. It's just all about finding cats. Holy shit, look at that dragon binding. It's all about searching for cats and sniffing people. It's kind of weird. Mmm, 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 sir. Sir, do you have bacon bits on you? I think you do. Sir, are you holding out on me? Sir, give me the bacon bits. Don't you look at me like that. You're your fire. And now back to Lost. <laughs> Mr. Kidding, good, you're here. I have something I need to tell you. I think, I think you might be my father, Mr. Kitty. <laughs> Wait, hold up. Listen, all right? Listen. Remember that crazy party you had back 33 years ago in that dumpster with that stray cat? Do you remember that, Mr. Kitty? <laughs> That's right. That's when it happened. <laughs> Search your feelings, Mr. Kitty. You know it to be right. <laughs> That's right, son. And you're my dad. Come here, dad. Ah, I love you so much. Can I borrow 20 bucks? Ah. Come on, I'm your son. Give me $20. Ah. Yoink. Ha ha, gotcha. Of course I'm not your son, you idiot. I'm a fucking ah. human. You're a cat. You weren't even alive 33 years ago, you idiot. Peace out. Woo. Hello. Sneako B. Back with some more Lost Judgment Kaido Files. When we last left off, we finally took control of our old pal Kaido here, who unlike Yagami, who likes to, to dance around obstacles, you know, when he's chasing after dudes, he'll leap over a guy's head and leap over an obstacle. And Kaido's like, nah, fuck that shit. Going head first, bitch. Boosh, blast his ass through that shit. Fuck, tackles the dude. Man handles the heck out of him. When he kicks a dude, he like throws his whole fucking body into his like, My motto is kick first, ask questions later. Always. And also, he loves sniffing stuff. He just can't get enough of sniffing stuff. He likes sniffing trash cans. He likes sniffing kitties. He likes sniffing other people. Mm, I just can't get enough of it. Ah! What's that smell? Oh, it was potato crisp. Mmm. Y'all won't mind if I spend some money on the, on the potato crisp. It'll come right on our payroll. It's fine. But yeah, aside from that, Yagami got approached by, uh, interestingly, seemingly the husband to a woman that he seemed to have a relationship with of some kind many years ago and who has seemingly killed herself. But according to the husband, she's been spotted somewhere and is actually potentially still alive and maybe is on the run? I, I don't know, but he wants us to see if we can't find her. Kaido declines the case, but... Come on, he's gonna fucking get to it, right? Though he's likely maybe gonna be doing more of his own investigation for himself than for the job, because he, like, literally turned down, like, 36 million yen. Counter, you stupid idiot! Do you have any idea how, how many potato crisps you could buy with that man? Oh, shit, I didn't think about that. Oh, fuck. Wait, come back! I gotta go back I got on the job! Ah! But it's good so far. I'm, I'm already liking what the direction is for this DLC, is in that it's really focusing on more about what like Kaido's background was because I feel like we really haven't gotten a whole lot of that like we got some in the last game about discussing a little bit of its time as a Yakuza right but it was more just kind of like references and not really like a deep look back and again it all just kind of revolved and came back around to Yagami so I kind of like that we're actually seemingly gonna spend some time to really dig into his time when he was younger what he did back then and how it's led to the person he is now but anyway last episode colin regan said no matter how much of a dork and the butt of jokes ashino can be can we all agree that he has excellent taste in women <laughs> i do kind of wish we got to see siori and his more casual interactions in game to get a feel of how they play off each other and get an idea of what it is about ashino that caused her to start dating him i agree i, I think they're kind of doing the japanese thing where it's like oh this girl's really popular with our fan base and despite us actually writing in the story of her dating one of the other characters we can't really ever show it or barely ever even discuss it which then just kind of leads you to like wonder like what the hell does she even see in this weenie dude does she like to dominate him because she's definitely let's be honest right she's the alpha of that fucking relationship all right she's wearing the pants does she know you bait a bitch but it does make me wonder like why even bother like having them in a relationship at all if it's not even something we're ever gonna like show or talk about or like briefly mentioned. Though I will say they're already in this DLC, we are talking about it more than we did at all in the main story, right? I mean, we have already now on like two separate occasions been like, oh yeah, maybe Hishino's gonna propose to Siori or something. So I don't know, maybe we'll actually see more of it later on in this DLC. But I do find it funny if, if this is the place that they decided to do it, how it was just like quite literally, like I actually wasn't even certain that they were dating 
in the main story of the game, it was brought up so rarely. But Colin, thank you so much for your uh, enlightening comment. And it is that reason you are comment of the day. But anyway, you guys did leave me a uh, few uh, helpful tidbits. First off, in regards to the uh, the game's memory points, where I only came across one last episode. So apparently those are a real pain in the ass to come across in this game. And one of the big reasons why that is, is that unlike the sniffing and the hearing, there aren't any additional skills that you can get to actually help you find where they are. You guys did say you can sort of piece together where some of them are, because some of them do refer to events from like the previous game, but they aren't actually all available. I think that's the big thing. Thing. They actually are not all available at the start. They will only start to show up more as you progress the story, which is definitely kind of weird. I, I definitely don't agree with that. That is kind of that is kind of annoying, actually. Because so I ran around like this entire city, right? And I actually managed to get pretty much all of like the Matsugane family crests and everything else. I got all 20. I've got the skills for that unlocked. But I only found one memory point. So I decided to look up and see where these memory points are. And apparently there's only three available in the first chapter of the game. Most of them you can unlock by chapter two. And then there's like one in chapter three. When I looked up where one of the other ones was that I couldn't find, I sort of realized, oh yeah. So I've been looking at the ground here. This one's literally on a fucking door, which explains why it wasn't quite as easy to notice. So, uh, wait, hey, hey, dude. Trigger note, dude. Oh my God, what the hell? Ah, you son of a bitch. Uh, 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 uh. Another thing you guys told me, and I've already sort of pieced together, is Kaido's repel move is fucking batshit. It is in absolutely insane. You could be like in the middle of a combo and just mashing square. And if the enemy attacks you at any point during that, you just counter them. It's like, it is insane and you get a boost to your fucking attack speed. Oh, I gotta look at it, right. The Omasakani family office. <laughs> Just remember the nickname Maya Niki had for me. Memories of brotherly love. Uh, the skill Gory Gory Finisher has been unlocked. But yeah, so I actually off screen, there were a couple of things that I hadn't found yet that I actually just found on my own. I think I managed to actually find pretty much all of the uh, the sniffing and hearing stuff just from running around the city. I kind of like doing that sometimes, you know? It's like the same thing. Remember that time I ran, I flew around the whole city looking for like, QR codes in the last judgment game. It's pretty much like that. But I did unlock the last of this one, the gift bra the gifted brawler, and I just, I just went ahead and bought it. So now I can get the most SP I can possibly get. That was, there was two things. There was that one that unlocked for getting 20 pendants. And then there was something else in here as well. I think it was, it was like one of these, one of these combos. But anyway, uh, gory, gory finisher. Kata used to hate it when his Aniki said he looked like a gorilla when he fought. He used to think his Aniki was taking shots at his looks. But now he understands it was out of affection and a recognition of his true strength. That was for you, Aniki! Three squares or four times, then triangle, triangle. Cool. The other one I got, though, or unlocked was, uh, because I also did the, uh, the ones that required, like, special, like, doing 10 aerial recoveries or, or aerial finishers or whatever to enemies or, like, the, the little bonus SP things that you get in, at the end of fights. Another one, another one was, like, go back to school or whatever, and that was just doing a, uh, a repel in a fight, doing 10 of those. And I unlocked this one, knife counter. Repel that causes the enemy to drop their weapon. After watching Tak deftly dodge knife attacks, gotta figure he could pull something off like that if he tried hard enough. So he came up with his own homebrew technique. Doesn't work on two hundred weapons, such as signboards or hammers. That just sounds really fucking good. So now while I'm just mashing square, I can also just mash a fucking weapon out of their hand. That's amazing. And then I guess, yeah, I'll go with the Gory Gory Finisher. Why not? Oh, <laughs> that looks funny. But I got a few other ones like this X Breaking Point Lone Wolf. At low health, greatly increases your attack power and X boost for Bruiser. Unstoppable. This makes it so I can't die. And enhanced reversal. Increases the effectiveness of Mortal Reversal at low health. You know, the usual shit. Increase the effectiveness of Mortal Reversal against bosses while X boost is active. That's kind of a specific one. Oh, and boost your X gauge after you defeat two enemies within three seconds of each other. That's kind of neat. Yeah, Kaga's actually some pretty cool stuff. That makes them pretty damn good. And seemingly, I'm going to get at least at least one more style because this does mention the ability to swap styles right here. So I should get at least, at least one more. But yeah, you guys were confirming what I thought. Like, that, yeah, this is easily just like Kiryu's brawler style, right? It's like his brawler combined with bits of like his other stuff, like maybe even some of his tank, his dragon style. It's actually pretty fun. I'm not going to lie. I really like the, the increase in attack speed because as good as that was for like Crane and as good as Crane still was overall i still found myself using mostly like boxer and tiger you know and then just whipping out the crane when i need to like do the the heat actions that killed a bunch of dudes oh shit can we see what the kata rocket 2.0 is 
That shit just sounds hilarious. All right, I also unlocked this thing. That, that was right. That, this is the other thing I unlocked with the, the 20 uh, the twenty pins, I believe. Was the, uh, this, iron liver. You no longer get hammered and can drink without limits. Bottoms up. Damn. That's right, Yager can't get a skill like that, can he? The fucking lightweight. But okay, so we're gonna head to Tender, seemingly to just, I guess, drink our sorrows away. I'm sure nothing's gonna ha interesting or crazy is gonna happen while I'm over there. But yeah, the other uh, memory point for this chapter is actually at Tender, so in inside the building. So like, look at this shit, just like, oh damn, you're, oh, you're gonna wait, night. now you're gonna do that? Come on, get up. I can't fucking do some cool shit unless you get up. Now try, now try and hit me. So one thing is when you when you get him with the repel move, it actually doesn't do any damage. But see me, I can just keep like mashing square, right? And like, God, and it gives you the huge fucking uh, attack speed boost. And you could be in the middle of a combo and you can still fucking hit like repel them. It is really good. All right, back to tender. Who the fuck? I swear to God, if that's Yagmi asked me to get him some more potato crisps, I swear to God, I already ate them all. Aniki. Oh, Shigaska. ちょっと見てきてもらえないですか。はあ。なんで俺がそんなそっちで勝利しようよ。おお、誰がドライ。ああ、それが今店に女の子のバイトしかいないんです。俺も新店舗の打ち合わせがあって。なんで俺が牡
おうおう<笑>派手にやってんなお嬢さん俺が来たからにはもう安心だヤクザじゃねえ No, I just used to be Calm down 東に言われてきたどういう状況だえ、えっとあの男の子が私を助けようとして、uh, 私がしつこく絡まれていたから So, okay I will say So I This character right here This is the character that's voiced by、uh, Paul Caster Jr., the guy who voiced Rindo. And I only know that because I've, I've actually visited the page of the, the voice actor for him on Twitter, and he has this guy listed down. So I, I believe he voices in the English dub this character right here as well, which is cool. Again, look at this. My freaking LPs getting tied together again, right? As they always tend to. And you're ugly. <laughs> <laughs> is that the same boy? I think it is. Just his, his hair dyed red. Supposed to be the son of that,、uh, that lady. Sagatrote. <laughs> <laughs> Did <laughs> 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 he piss himself too? Shit! This guy's like, damn, I'm a badass. Hey, <laughs> Mojo-san! <laughs> I'm gonna break all of Higashi's arcade machines. Hey, I just got a, a disarming move. You want to see it? Want me to try it out on you? Okay. Oh, shit. So, I guess we want us to play Bouncer, eh? I guess it's time to dust off some old moves. Oh, fuck. Oh, shit. The tank style? Oh, my God. It gets the, um. It wasn't called tank, though. It was called、uh, the B style. But it was basically the tank style. Like, literally, you just, you're super slow, but you, are, you have armor for days. And you literally don't even, like, don't even guard. You just stand there flex. And it, it looks like his stance is actually the same as, as a curious B style, too. When you use tank, long ago when Kata was a bodyguard for his patriarch, he'd come to his defense like a fully armored tank. Tank style combines a fierce. Weapon based offense with an impenetrable defense. Grab and smash lets Kaido automatically pick up and strike with a weapon with square. Oh, this is. Yeah, that I think it was the, the exact same thing in、uh, with B style. And he can weather attacks from any direction using Iron Guard. Tank style is also excellent for grabs. With the right skills, Kaido can grab enemies in all sorts of situations. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, there it is. Holy shit. That's awesome. That's actually really smart to bring back the beast style for Kaido. So, perfect iron guard, a stunning defensive technique that allows you to deflect most attacks when Kaido performs an iron guard, just as enemy lance attacks. Deadly attacks, bullets, and other powerful attacks cannot be deflected. So, he deflects that shit, huh?、Ugh! Flex that shit off. So, he, this gets its own hidden, hidden style. Temporarily increases defense after performing a perfect iron guard. Wow. So, you get a, you get a defensive boost and a, an attack speed boost. That's pretty sick. Iron Break. Perfect Iron Guard can be formed during a rush combo. Oh my god, are you fucking kidding me? I can cancel out of my rush combo to perform an Iron Iron Guard? That's amazing. Okay, so how do I. Okay, I'm not. I am not slow. I'm a little bit, but I can actually still like unlock and move around. That was not possible with Kiryu. And I can also still do my quick step. It's like a more mobile fucking beast style. That's awesome. Uh, yep. Oh, no, no, tickle me. Hit me, dip, dip shit. Oh, there we go. Stiffed. Oh, shit. It's actually not hard to pull off either. It's very forgiving. Oh, now I'm pissed. Oh,、uh, uh, the color of this fucking doll is purple.、Uh, Die. Oh my gosh, this is mine. I broke all shit. Whatever. We're bros. Don't forgive me. Sick. Shinchi. Tatta to usura. Kusuge! Damn, I'm gonna try to try my disarm move. 
I'm so busy tanking it. Hey, how you doing? Wake up, bitch. あれ人助けは関心だが、ガキが大人二人相手は無茶だろう。おはい、大丈夫かあ、あれお前、いや、前にどこかで。ああ、あんた。松金組のカイトを正春だな。そうだが、松金組なら特訓に抜けたが。俺は貞本じゃん。あんたを探してたんだ。貞本。その名前どこかで。あ。いや。お前、ミキコの。ようやく会えたな。<笑> マツガネ組のヤクザだって聞いてたからさ、それらしいけど、バーダーだ。ポテンシャリー。解散したとか聞いてびっくりしたぜ。ランアウェイボーイ、ジュンサラモト。おい。ミキコの息子がなんで俺
All this time, Rindo was fucking Kaido's son. <laughs> Look at Kaido's face. Oh shit! Ah, oh, fuck! What goes around? What goes around indeed does come around. Cool. Nice start to this. All right. I I'm invested. I'm interested. Previously. I will say it has all the, the flourishes and fanfare and cinematography of the, like, the main story, which is pretty great, right? It definitely does not feel like they cut any corners here. I was surprised that's Sagashi uh, narrating this. Chapter 2, like father, like son. Wait, who was narrating Yagami's side of the story then? Was it Genda? I think it might have been Genda. 16 years ago, yes! Give me them sweet flashbacks! <laughs> Yeah, look at baby Kaido. He's got a different shirt. その日俺はトラブルだという組からの電話を受け、急いで事務所に向かっていた。おい、トラブルって何が勝ち込みだよ。それも女のな。え、女がうちに勝ち込みを。ええ。組長が車で帰らねえとか抜かしてよ。めんどくせえことになったら。見ろ。ふざけないで。いたたたたたたたたたたたたたたたたたたたたたたたたたたたたたたたたたたたたた
この女がいきなり事務所に殴り込んできたんだよ妹を返せってねそれじゃあ妹さんは先に事務所にいたのかあ今日からうちで結物してるキャバで働いてもらうことになってたからねこの女いきなり殴り込んできたと思ったら親父に会わせろとか抜かしてよルースだって言ったら親父嫁だの部屋で待つだの騒ぎ出してだって下っ端と話してもらちが開かないでしょファンスライスがすごいスーパーハッさてとヘイベイビーさあ今日はこのことを見てのよえそう怖い顔してちゃ美人が大好きだよ<笑>カイドはここはお互い笑顔で話し合おうよ<笑>カイド、I swear you're about your ass beat, dude. 話し合えばきっと分かり合えるさ。お、そうだ。近くにいいバーがあってな。テンダーだ。ナンパなら外でやって。わ、悪かった。Dad, just fucking kill me. Stop hitting her, you dickhead. You stupid horn dog. Fuck. I mean here? No? I mean here? What are you? I'm looking at your dick. I think you're a dick. What? Hey, you. I see you. You look at the face of a, about 300 guys I've killed. You know, the funny thing is, the main story of the game actually did away with this, right? Actually getting a SP from like looking at everything. And now they they actually brought it back for Kaido here. But it makes sense because I mean, this is going to be a relatively short experience. And I'm actually, it's actually giving me decent SP too. So it's not a, not a bad choice here. Nice bonsai tree. This is cool though, because this, this already is showing that Kaido had like a knack for this, even 16 years ago, right? He's not, he's not just a, a big meathead gorilla. He actually does have some intelligence. My parents just are deceiving. I'm the smartest gorilla in this goddamn city. Eat your heart, I kill you. Is there anything else in here? Oh wait, it's probably sniffing. That's right. I gotta sniff shit. How can I forget? Ugh, my, my strongest asset here. I smell red, sweet red beans coming from this box. Probably Yokan from Takamitsu. So what here this morning? Does someone bring them? Uh, any more to things to sniff? Wait, I see something over there. And you. <gasps> Damn, this tree smells good. Fuck. It smells something, but it doesn't seem like anything important. Oh, I got some sweet ass pizza. It's all good. It smells fridge too. It smells like the fridge. Oh yeah, I put the bento I bought yesterday in there. What's the crowd about that? Can't forget to take it back with me. Mm, oh! Wait, did I actually get that? And then I held on to that, that bento box for 16 years. It's still good, all right? I'm sure it's still perfectly edible. All right, I can hear your fucking heartbeat. Or he said all that out loud on purpose, or he's just a dumbass. It's a plate, huh? This is what he was hiding. Sake! Well, I'll just confiscate that. Man, is she pissed. Pretty impressive pulling a judo move on a yaksa like that, though. Dude, I don't even like this guy. Have at it. Shoot <laughs> 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 Ugh, such a shit show. Fuck me. Oh. oh. Huh? What's this paper? Korewa. Resume. Must be that woman's. Is her name Mikiko Natsume? See, the, the thing down doing here, though. Is she on her way to an interview or something? Alright, there we go.
なるほどね事情はよく分かったよ夏目美紀子さん女の勝ち込みだって聞いたから何事かと思ったがどうやらあんたら姉妹はこの状況に限って言えば被害者だったみたいだなえ血の気の多いやつばかりであんたも困ったろあんたらには俺から謝罪させてもらうよ何が言いたいのあんたが事務所に乗り込んできたのは妹さんの借金踏み倒して連れ帰ろうとしたわけじゃなかった少なくとも殴り込みするつもりはなかったことだけは確かだこいつを見てくれ、uh, レズメあんたの履歴書だだからえー、っとだなこれが結果としてあんたがやろうとしたことを証明してくれるわけだがその前にあんたが事務所に殴り込みじゃなく話し合いに来たってことをこいつらに分かってもらう必要がある回りくどい結論から話してガッ Hell the woman she is Oh that was it Oh Uh, oh, box of sweets. そのカシオリアンタガモテキタンダロツマリスクナクトモアンタワナグリコミジャネハナシアヨシタカタテコトニナルアナタタダノキニクゴリラジャナイミタイダネ If you take it on your second try ダガソノハナシアヨザネンナガラシッパイニオアタミタイダナソノゲインガナンダタノカワこいつを見ればわかるバンズあんたの妹さん胸元のボタンが外れてるな貸し折りまで持って話し合いに来たってのにホッタがいきなり妹さんの胸ぐらにつかみかかっただからあんたは妹さんを守るためにホッタを締め上げたってわけかあなたヤクザなんかより探偵とかの方が向いてるんじゃない、nope, that's not a bad idea, though. <笑>ヤクザ引退するようなことがありゃそれもいいかもなだがなミキコさん今回の件あんたの妹さんにも非があることは確かだそうだろうサービス利用したらその対価を支払うのが筋だそこは分かってくれるなそんなことは分かってるそもそもお金を返さないなんて一言も言ってないでしょあそうなのかこの子真帆は地元の短大に通ってるの東京のキャバクラなんかで働き出したらタイなんて取れない真帆にはちゃんと卒業させて普通に就職させて普通に幸せな生活を送ってもらいたいのだったら実家のご両親にでも借金立て替えてもらうかそそれは無理うちの両親超一社頭なんだからホスト言ってたことがバレたら感動されちゃういや自業自得だろうが<笑>要するにお金を払えばいいんでしょ300万今日はその支払い方法について相談に来たのよそれなのにこいついきなり魔法につかみかかってうたたたたあんたの妹名前言うからだろ<笑>なあミキさんどう払うつもりだ She is sacred here. 300万も払うあてあるのかよ<笑>私新宿で働いてるの昼は普通に OL やってるけど夜は結構自由に使える学生の時は接客業だっていろいろしてたの水商売の経験はないけどバイトしてたカフェでは3年連続ベスト接客賞を取ってるキャバクラで働くなら妹よりは向いてると思うけどあはいあんたまさか私がこの子の代わりに働くあんたたちが大好きな筋ってのもそれで通るんじゃないカオサク I love this woman <笑>それがミキコとの出会いだった
ミキコがその性格の明るさと切符の良さからあっという間に人気を獲得していったが、シュピタファカラ、そもそも、その気の強さもあって、よく客とトラブルを起こした。ああ、彼女の血持ちをすることになった俺は、しばしばミキコの起こすトラブルに対処するようになっていった。なるほど。それでそのミキコって女が代わりにキャバクラで。それかし、妹さんのためとはいえ。I think it is, yeah. Baby Higashi! I'm not sure if I'm going to be a little bit of 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 a little bit お前がしっかりケツ持って関西させるなら文句はないってさそうですかだったら兄貴その女に逃げられないように気をつけないとですねそれなら心配はねえありゃあ約束破って逃げるような玉じゃねえさ俺にはわかるそれ again な何しやがんだうちはおさわり禁止なの言ってもわからない客には出てってもらうよお,お前さすがオスのシーキー俺にこんなことしてただでそると思ってんのかあんたこそモモコちゃんに手出してただで済むと思ってんのミキコちゃんもういいって私は大丈夫だからモモコちゃんは隠れてて。Suddenly, a whole bunch of other dudes came out. Ah, oh, damn it! Oh, look at that chuck you got. Think about to have a flashback fight. Miko! <laughs> Miko! I'm a coming! <laughs> Holy shit! Somehow they hit, they hit five dudes at once. Yo, Jimbo, da. Kono no no cream nara. Orega kikuze. Hot damn, boy! Come here! Come back! Here is that! Here is that! Oh shit, yep, here we go. Flashback time! All right, good. At least I stole my two styles here. Come at me! Oh shit! I wasn't ready. Ah! Oh, oh, okay. Can't guard that. Come here, bitch. Ow! Oh, fucking clothesline! Do it again. Ow! Oh, I got an iron gullet. Let's go. Hit me. Oh, wait, not you. You hit me. Come on. Okay. No, I want to do the damn thing on the guy with the weapon here. Shit. Damn it, it's really kind of fast. I'm gonna die, aren't I? Fuck it. Holy shit! <laughs> that was dope. Maybe it's possible I don't have the skill? Yet, in the past, I, I don't think so. I imagine I just have all my skills. I wouldn't imagine I'd go that far. Right? Come on. Oh, actually, no, I maybe I don't. So I think I'm doing it. But the problem is I'm, uh... Like, I'm repelling. Yeah, that's the, that's the repel, but it's not giving it to me. Not giving me the, uh, the status change. So I think, yeah. Wow, that's actually a pretty decent attention to detail then. I figure I'd just have all my moves, you know, for reasons. Sorry. 
Sure, my ass kicked too. Yeah, see, I took that knife to the gut like 10 times. Fucking badass, eh? Hey? Shop, I've got a Sega over there. That's it. If you're looking for a PS5, you go somewhere else. お前の親父さんが忘れてったもんだ。ふん。そうか。で、さっきの話の続きだ。えっと、なんだ。お前が俺のガキだって。I'm your father. ガキじゃねえ。息子だ。日本語は正しく使えよ、おっさん。ふん。まあ、とりあえず話聞かせろや。親父さんは、ミキコが生きてるかもしれないって言ってたな。ああ、あの母ちゃんが自殺するわけないからな。ずっとおかしいと思ってたんだ。だが、DNA鑑定の結果は一致したんだろう。だったら、さすがに生きて
結婚決めた直後に妊娠が発覚したんじゃねえかなだから言えなかったんだきっと Just given the timing, it's not possible. Huh? Mate, yo. Kari ni o mai ga ore no gaki da to shitara. O mai no oyaji san wa tanin no musuko ga Mikiko no haran naka ni iru te wakatta ue de kekkon shita te no ga? Ma, so nan cha ne? Yeah, sasu ga ni tame na u da ro. それだけ母ちゃんに惚れてたってことじゃねえかなそうなのかうん。それだけ母ちゃんに惚れてたってことじゃねえかなそうなのかなあ、純って言ったな。ミキコはどんな母ちゃんだったんだどんなあなんつうか、かっこいい母ちゃんだった。かっこいい困ってる人とか見ると放っておけないみたいでさチンピラに絡まれてる人とか強引にナンパされてる女とか見るとバーって言って注意してさビッタファッカーそれで喧嘩になりかけることもあって親父は大慌て<笑>そうかそれで引き受けてくれるのかよ母ちゃん探すの言っておくがよ一応俺はプロの探偵だ。You're gonna pay me 36 million? Like your dad? お前金持ってねえだろ<笑>それなら心配いらねえ。なんだこりゃ腕時計親父の書斎から持ってきた。派手な時計だな。いくらすんだこんなもん。だいたい2000万くらいらしいぜ。Holy fuck! あなんだって2000万円だ。<笑>バカいえ。これが2000万エビス屋に行けば3万くらいで売ってるだろう、こんなもん。No, I know you're full of shit. 大体な、2000万もする腕時計があるわけねえだろうが。お前は社会勉強が足りてねえな。だったら調べてみろよ。時計に会社の名前書いてあるだろ。His full of shit, I know it. Fucking full of goddamn. Eh, so, what do you mean by that? I'm not sure. 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 親父はこんなのたくさん持ってるぜこれが1980万社会勉強が足りてねえなおまかしバスのなあおっさんそれやるから母ちゃん探してくれよ<笑>いらねえのか勝手に持ってきたもんだろうが親父さんに返しとけじゃあ引き受けてくれないのかあおおいおっさんどこ行くんだよ決まってんだろうミキコを探すおっさんおっさんじゃねえカイトウだおっカイトウのおっさん Don't call me dad either, right? Weird me out で、どっから探すんだカムロ町って言っても広いだろう。Listen to the show, man ミキがよく通っていた喫茶店がある喫茶アルスだ It's always Cafe Alps, isn't it? The one cafe in this entire fucking state 休みの日はよくあそこでコーヒー飲みながら本読んでたよえー、だったら顔出す可能性あるなとりあえず当たってみるぞ。Thankfully, it's、uh, right over there! Alright, let's get some stuff for my tank. Like, uh, Camberlain increased in defense after forming a perfect iron guard. That sounds good. It tame the hit by a tank battle bonus a certain number of times, okay? And then another prime ally thing. Oh, yeah, I think I, I can go get these now, can't I? Oh, it also obtained the stiffed battle bonus a certain number of times. 
Let's see what the fuck that is. So this just sounds incredible. Perfect iron guard can be performed during a rush combo. That is nuts. All right, real quick. Before we go do this thing, let's just go ahead and get the fucking other memory point things. There's one. Club and more. Oh, yeah, that's where I stood up for Mikiko and got in a huge fight back in the day. Oh, okay. So it is. There, the counter rocket. Awesome. What does that do? That just sounds hilarious. Back during his bouncer days, kind of a move where he'd run up and uh, he's also meant to unleash an explosive attack. Oh, like that giant diving move movie he did in the cutscene. Dubbed by his friends as the Kata Rocket. Reliving the memory, he came up with this new and improved version. A charge level is added for extra power. Press and hold triangle. Oh, shit. That's awesome. Hear that, kid? Here I fucking drop kicked like five dudes at once. Whatever, dad. You're so full of shit. I told you not to call me dad. Get away. So I wonder if he fights with me. Ah, oh, stiff. Oh, I got me all stiff. Uh, okay, so what's the one that it brought up here? Stiff is the perfect iron guard. Oh, hit by a tank. That's it. So that's going to kill a few enemies <laughs> while in the style. And nope, he just seems to watch. Wait, where the fuck is he? Oh, uh, this move seems very good. Boost your X-Gage after being two enemies within three seconds of each other. Holy shit. What the fuck? Okay, that one was definitely not easy to see. Hidden right behind this sign over here. Whoa, this is where Masagane sign got attacked. Put my life on the line to protect him back that day. Took a real shine to me from then on. Memories of Reckless Charge. The Masagane Bulldozer. I see now why they don't all unlock at once, though. You don't get this second style until literally the end of Chapter 1. That's why it, it does not unlock. A powerful technique reminiscent of a time when Kaido grabbed a neon sign and charged a group of gun-toting Yakuza to protect Masagane. Hold L1 and then press X while holding a large weapon. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Actually, I think we... I think uh, Kira had something similar for the beast style. They like, pick it up and they just like... Actually, no, I don't know. You wouldn't... You couldn't really run in that style. Basically, you could like run at dudes while shielding yourself. Cool. Oh my god. Okay. No, you guys are right. This is some bullshit. <laughs> what in the fuck? How the fuck is anyone supposed to stumble across that? What? I like how some of these... This is really inconsistent, too. Like, some of these are, like, lying on the ground or within eye level. And then other ones are like... No, you gotta look way the fuck up here. This is Hamura's favorite sauna. Man, we had... He had me doing some crazy shit here back when I just joined up. The Matsugane Mixer. Okay, yeah, I'm definitely seeing why you guys are saying he's a guy. That is some... I don't think I ever would have come across that. Oh, this is the one I need the... I need the stiff thing as well, though. So I actually can't see what it is yet. Hey, look, son. Your dad's gonna show how, how, how you how to be an upstanding citizen. Here, lady, look. And with that, I get a rice cracker. Ew. Yeah, that's kind of gross. She's gonna give me like gold plates and shit. Give me something cool, lady. I'm trying to impress my son. I thought you said I wasn't. You, you weren't my dad. I'm not your dad. Shut up. Stop calling me that. Oh fuck. Oh yeah. I was talking to my son. You asshole. Ah. 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 Man, fuck this. Ah. Oh, I'm so fucking angry. At least this was at eye level. It's the building where Hamura held me hostage. I was thinking that Hamura forced another guy out of the family before the before me. I wonder how he's doing. <laughs> Hamura, that was the guy from last game, I believe. The human helicopter. Ah, those were the good old days. One of Kaido Zaniki's in the Masakai fam was an ex-wrestler who would toss people around like ragdolls when he got drunk. This is his go-to move when dealing with drunk customers. Hold R1, input... A dodge with X and then circle. Interesting. And then suddenly this one just is here. Over Charles. Just remember that time some Yakuza tried to show off their boxing chops by picking on Agashi. Agashi wouldn't touch them since they outranked him. So I beat their ass on his behalf. God, I'm cool. Gutsy grab. One time during an attack on the Masagane family, Kaido grabbed a hold of a pro boxer who was pummeling Kaido the whole time and beat him utterly senseless. With enough willpower, skill gaps are meaningless. Press circle while taking damage. Oh, shit. An armored command grab, basically? That's... That's dope. Okay, and apparently there's one in here. Even though before I actually couldn't walk through this door. But now I can! Hey, what's up, guys? And also... Wait, do I smell some shit? Wait. Am I smelling a 
Do you stink too? Why do you stink? Dude, where, uh, where am I going? Why'd I do that? Son, why do you smell so weird? Where am I even looking? Oh, Is there a free food? Shit. All right, can I hear you too? No. Yeah, stop looking at me, you weirdo. Damn it, I gotta get back up there again. <laughs> you just leaped out the window for no reason. What we got in here? Smell something, something around here. Some stiff boxers in the fridge for whatever reason. What? Also, I found this demonic fundoshi. Which was really good. Plus 20% attack or defense and 50% attack increases the X gauge by 10%. That's fucking really good. What does this one do? I don't want to worry about confident fighters. It's high impact resistance for being mass reduced. 10% defense reduces agony by 5%. Eh, nope. I'll start my Fundoshi, thanks. Hey, Sheena, what's up, you nerd? Yo, Hoshino-kun. Yeah, I'm going to cut scene here. Yeah. Saori san mo gaishitsu shite ite. Ore? It's my son. こいつの母ちゃんを探しててな。へえ。お母さんのために自分で依頼に来るなんて偉いね。ちゃんと依頼料だって用意してきたんだぜ。2000万の腕時計だ。2000万の腕時計。冗談だよね。No, <笑> His dad's loaded! ディレクションを薄れてきたんだとよ。君、よかったら今度お父さんに僕を紹介してくれるかな。顧問弁護士とか必要だったりしない。シャバシノ。はあ?あ、しなくん。お前な。あ、あ、やだな。冗談ですよ
今度おかしな男が来たら私に言いなさいまさか何かあったら地元まで押しかけてくる気 ?Yes! 必要ならね Please, I want to! もうやめてよ恥ずかしいお姉ちゃんは過保護なんだよお姉ちゃん私も社会人になるんだからさいい加減妹離れしてよホストで借金作るような子だからね心配するなっていう方が無理だよほらこないだだって怪しいセミナーに入りそうになってたでしょ感銘を受けた Sounds like a curious sub story あれは気の迷いというかま、まほちゃんみたいないい女は脇が甘いと危ねえってことだそこはお姉ちゃんを見習いな<笑>カイトさんありがとうけどそれってお姉ちゃんもいい女だって意味だよねあそれはその No, shut up I say anything Fucking kind of man spreading there Who the fuck is that? やばお父さんたち待たせてるの忘れてた Their parents or something? カイトウさんに挨拶しろって言ったのに外で待ってるって聞かないんだもん失礼だよねマサハルさんごめんねいや俺こそご両親に気使わせちまったみてえだな大丈夫カイトウさんとお姉ちゃんのことは私からも説得しておくからカイトウさんマジいい人だってさなんてったって私は二人の出会いのきっかけを作ったあしてんわいてきゃんわいてきゃんわいてきゃんわいてきゃんわいてきゃんわいてきゃんわいてきゃんわ I guess they don't want to say hi to him because they don't approve of their relationship or whatever. When was the last time I was here with Mikiko? The last time I ever saw Mao chan. I wonder how Mao chan's doing now. She has her own family at this point. Still sniff around it. You know what I mean? Huh? Huh? Come on, if you're my son, you, you're gonna sniff it too. You have to be. Hey, baby. Baby, have you seen this? Have you seen this lady? Eh? Baby, look at this picture, alright? Look at it. Have you seen this? Have you seen this lady? And then the baby looks up at him and he's like, Yes, we'll never find her, Kaido san. She's gone with the wind. What the hell? What'd you do to them, baby? What'd you do? Oh my god, this man's harassing my baby! Ha! I'll never tell Kaido. Ha 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 ha! Now give me milk, mommy! Yes, baby! Damn it! Damn that baby! Damn that evil baby! Anyway. Oh, I'm gonna talk to this guy. We're getting we're asking around random people. It's really the search one is about a month. For stars, let's see if I can narrow it down. Find someone who might have seen her recently. Wait, so what am I doing? Here go, look at the guy. No? Or this guy. Dude, I'm looking at head tie. Fuck off. Yeah, <laughs> いちいち他のお客なんて見てないよいやそこをなんとかさ記憶の片隅とかに残ってたりしないか<笑>そう言われてもな It's only this guy of June What about you guys? For a fucking goddamn mistake out of the right angle there Ugh. Wait, no This side, where do you want me to stand? Fucking Are you kidding me? What the hell? <laughs> ah! Wait, I saw it. I saw for a second I have to be like bent over it. There we go. Damn it! What am I gonna do? Talk to you? Nah, shit. Just a little bit. What's up? Have you seen this woman? I don't think I've seen her. You can remember me. I've seen her for a few weeks. Ah, how do you think? 先週俺彼女と旅行行ってたんでその時来てたらわからないっすね他の店員に聞いてみてください店長ならわかるかもしれません
そうか店長はどこにさっきまでいたんですけどねどこかな He's outside getting beat up by some Yakuza. わかんないっすねまあいい探してみる Gathering until he's probably out back. Where the fuck is he? Hey! Hey, wake the fuck up. f u c k i n g gonna wake this guy up. Urgh, urgh, urgh. Come on. Come on. Fuck it. No! No, I can't break any of them! No! Ah! What a buzzkill. Oh, I guess this guy's Cafe Elf's manager. Wake up, bitch! だよ、昼寝中かおいちょっといいか Kick him, Kaido. おいダイアンマジで起きねえぞこいつ何とかして起こせねえかな Primal focus. Oh, now you're telling me. Maybe if I sniff him. It's from focus walking around. How's that gonna help me here? Just gotta sniff him? Oh, shit. Oh, fuck. I don't wanna do that. I smell some stink. Oh, t w o t o sandwich. Mmm. Just what I needed. Okay, I can hear something. Wait, what the fuck? Oh, he's got his. He's got his AirPods in. Or is that headphones on? I can hear anything go going on with those. I believe it's, it's time we lose them. There, that'll do some good. Hey! Akira! Or not. Akira! Oh, fuck! Kim! Don't you stand him around me. You sub it to m o k i n e k u r e d a Motu de Kai Oto de Motasanito Oksoni Nena. Could punch him. Very good at that. Sniff him. Sniff this man. Damn it!、Hmm? Wait, leg. Oh, I could pull his chair out from under him.、Ah, scratch that. That could actually hurt him. l e t figure out something else. It's alright. The idea did give me SP. That's all I give a crap about. Oh, wait. Oh, fuck yeah! Megaphone, what's this doing here? I'm gonna use this somehow. Yes, yes! Stick it right in his fucking face. Get ready to die. Wake up! Wake up! Ah! 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 Hey, what's up? Ohio! ちょっと聞きたいことがあってなはあ何でしょう Fine, get some more of this guy Holy shit, I got a bunch of SP for waking this man up Good, I fucking deserve it Let's go and get this, iron liver I will never get drunk, ever 俺は八神探偵事務所のカイトーってもんだちょっと人を探していてな人をこの女性客で来てなかったか行方不明らしいんだが昔よくこの店に通ってた人なんだんこの人を見たのか見たというか昔の常連さんでね確かミキコさん Damn, good memory. おおそうだ覚えてたのかええ彼女には何度か助けてもらいましたからほらこの町は柄の悪いやからが多いでしょそういう連中に絡まれた時は彼女がつかつかとやってきて追い払ってくれたんです<笑>そういえばそんなこともあってなあそうかあなたあの人のたまに一緒に来てましたよねほらいつも窓際の席に座って Dude, how long have you been here? 消せって言ってんだよなんだなんだ Damn it, June, what'd you do? 
Whatever, man. It's an e-cig, okay? 2022, bitch. Ah! <laughs> Doing just what the mom did. Hey, isn't that one of Migigo's moves? Sick. Get him, son. Oh, good. It's been five minutes since I beat somebody up. No, I want to do it in here. Oh. The Aragaki brothers? When are you guys gonna fucking learn? And I'll show you what true power is. Holy shit! Come on, hit me. Come on. Shit. I was sick. Big side. Hit by a tank. <laughs> I love it. All right. Good talk. Bye. Sansta no chimpira ga nido to kuru na. Jun, hito dasuke wa kanshin da ga aite wa miro. Kono machi wa ara poi renchu ga oi kara na. Ah, wakatta yo. Tokoro de, omae sakke chimpira no ude shime agete da ro? Are te. Ah, kaachan kara mukashi osowatta go shinjutsu da. そうか。ミキコから。色々と教えてもらったんだ。母ちゃん趣味でご真実とかキックボクシングとかいろいろやってたから。そういえばミキコ言ってたな。昔親がいないとか言われてよくいじめられてた真帆ちゃんを守るため
そんじゃあ次はそこで聞き込みだな店長情報提供ありがとうないやいやこちらこそ今日は助かりましたあらいクールあらいメイクプログレス<laughs> look at it. Look at it, young dopey Kaido. All right, let's go ahead and get alcohol aficionado. Increase the X charge rate even further when I'm drunk. And it plays slower when I'm drunk. Being drunk is great. I don't have a problem. You have a problem. But all right, guys. I think this is probably a good place to end things here for now. Ooh, this is getting good, man. I'm really appreciating all these flashbacks, actually. I think it's I think it's pretty great. And I think, I guess, saying we did see Kaido in a couple of flashbacks in the original Judgment, but I don't think it was like a huge focus, right? Aside from that one time that, like, I think somebody broke into the Matsugame office, right? Or was it Yagami? So we, like, broke into the safe, so, something like that involving Kaido. So I'm liking that we're seeing this, too. And also, again, just showing the fact that Kaido actually is a pretty smart guy, even back when he was younger. And he's not just a big meathead. But anyway, I hope you all enjoyed this episode. If you did, please leave a like and a favorite. And subscribe if you're not already become a Piggy Penguin. A boy, this LP. Where the days are always sunny and the vids are always funny. And as always, guys, till next time, stay classy.